morning campers! So today I'm going to be testing out an online fashion retailer called Refashion. And I have this very large, very rustly bag here full of Refashion clothes. For those of you who don't know, Refashion is an online selling platform which sells donated clothes on behalf of charity shops who may not be able to run their own shop or online store. Refashion's charity partners currently include Copperfield, Make-A-Wish and Breast Cancer Now, but they also regularly partner with new charities. Refashion has clothes from many different high street stores as well as some designer bargains, so it's well worth going to take a look. You can donate to Refashion too, the links are here and here. So, without further ado, let's get in to the opening. Bag is like horrendously noisy. Really hard. So first up, I have a skirt, a little leatherette type of skirt. Um, it actually looks and feels pretty much brand new, which, considering it's second hand, it's obviously been looked after by previous owners pretty well. Got little zippy bits on it here. Oh, they're actually pockets. They're not very deep. Though, as you can see but I'll probably get a few coins in there on a night out possibly my phone or keys and I've got one on that side and there's one on the other side as well oh there's even like a little 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 refashion tag in the back all right wait, let's hop over to the camera so you can see it it says on the back Make some room. Free up space in your wardrobe for this gorgeous garment by having a declutter. Donate the clothes you no longer need to charity. Order a donation bag online. And again, gives you the link that's going to be in the comments. Description. <laughs> you can put that correction on there. So, originally, this skirt was from Dorothy Perkins, so... It's quite well-known quality. So, I'm going to get into the trying on. Oh, this actually fits quite well, although I would like it to sit slightly higher on my waist because at the minute it's sitting right on my hips and it kind of wants to sit up here. Mm, pulled in a little bit, but that's because I have an absolutely tiny waist compared to my hip size. Uh, yeah, I actually quite like the length as well. A lot, a lot of the time I find that mini skirts are quite short on me or they tend to ride up a bit on the back and this one's actually all right it sits exactly where i want it to sit the pockets i said earlier i probably get like some coins or a phone in and yeah probably functional and my hands kind of fit in them i could stand there looking cool if i my hands in my pockets at some point so yeah really happy with this one thumbs up from me next up we have once I've unfolded it, where I can find the tucked holders, we have a little play suit. Now, originally, according to the labels in the back, this was from this was Topshop, as you can see. And again, it's got the little refashion tag in the back. This is actually quite pretty, so. Oh, there's a zip in the back. Let's do that up so I can hold it by the camera a bit better. So, obviously, this has got quite a low back, as you'll see. And it's got little tie bits here to tie up in a bow at the back. And then it's patterned with all little cranes and little flowers. It's actually quite a nice um, play suit for summer. It's feels quite nice actually. It's nice and silky, so it's going to be great for when the heat actually arrives in Britain, because you know what British summers are like. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, rain, rain, even more rain. So when the heat wave actually starts, if it ever does, or if I decide I'm going to go on holiday somewhere nice to actually dry off for once, <laughs> this, I think I feel this would be quite nice. This sort of says summer barbecue to me or lounging around in the summer garden. It's quite formal as well, so you could probably dress it up with heels or dress it down by just wearing it with normal sandals, really. Let's go and try this on. This is play suit. 
These arms are a bit. I thought they'd be like. They're a bit flappy. Flappy. So I can go back to take off. <laughs> I kind of thought there'd be another button further down. There's one here. But I thought there'd be one at the bottom. Um, but I can live with that. I can live. However, I could always put another button on if necessary. Ignore my arm. Unfortunately, one of the neighbour's cats decided that I wasn't feeding him enough dreamies, which were for my cat, and he decided to go for my arm, hence the scratches. Um, yeah, I actually quite like the length of the sleeves. For me, I find that one of the things I struggle with most is the length of arms on long sleeve tops and shirts. A lot of the time, they tend to fit me about here, so they won't look more three quarter length than actual full length but these are quite fine they're actually slightly over long and I, I, I quite like that especially when I'm out in the sun so from the back it's quite low backed and um, it ties up quite well as well so far this bow has stayed in hopefully it stays in for a while when I'm wearing it and the material isn't so silky that after a while it just unravels itself Otherwise, I'm going to end up with long ties all the way down the back of my legs. Um, in terms of the length of it and the fit of it around my waist, yeah, I'm pleasantly surprised actually. I have a lot of problems with things fitting over my waist and hips. So I've got ultra tiny, tiny waist and then quite big hips. And um, yeah, it fits across the chest quite well as well. And yeah, I quite like this. Thumbs up from me. My third and final item is, of course, we have a bag, which is now empty. Here you go, have a bag. Ow. Is, this is a jumpsuit. Oh, it's all like, all caught up around the bottom of the legs all tangled up. But yeah, as you can see, by the little flappy bits which are flapping around everywhere, <laughs> these little chiffon -y flappy bits, it's going to be quite a dramatic thing. And this, actually, this has still got the tags on. This is like actually brand new, so this must have been an absolute bargain. I think this cost me about nine pounds, I think. So, nine pounds for something that's brand new and it's going straight to a charity is absolutely fantastic. So, yeah, it's got the refashion tag on it again. And this was originally from Boohoo, so. Yeah, and it's the boutique as well. Excellent. So, I'm going to go and try this on. This is the jumpsuit. As you can see, it's got a rather lovely cape on it. It's really nice and flowy, actually, this cape. And it's actually keeping my arms warm. It's middle of winter now, and this house is quite cold, and I've got bare arms. But they're actually quite nice and warm underneath here. The downside is, as you can see from the floor, they're a bit long, so I'm going to have to get my mum to turn them up and she's going to have to turn the trousery bits up as well because even though I've got heels on, they're still a little bit too long. Yeah, but as for the rest of it, the fit of it is completely fine. I mean, yeah, it's a bit low cut for me, but I could put another bra on with it and it fits nicely around my waist, my ultra tiny waist. It I do keep thinking, however, it's got pockets in it because of how bulky the seams are. As you can see from the side, the seams are quite bulky and it suggests that there might be pockets there. There aren't pockets! I'm getting catfished by seams where there are no pockets! Absolutely good. But anyway, I actually really like this. I can picture myself wearing this at least for one of the weddings that I've got to go to next year. And... Swish! And... Geez. Going to wedding is not funerals. Ow! <laughs> you look like a Dementor. Dementor? Me? Yeah. Snake, snake, server a snake. Snake, snake, server a snake. <laughs> yeah, more like Snape, I think. But I get the whole like. Dementor, Dementor kind of vibes. This would be great for Halloween, actually, as well. It'd perfect for Halloween. Yeah. Although, at the minute, it doesn't really go with Christmas. And it's also a bit... Ah, Lord Vader, I'm so pleased to see you. 
No. Or perhaps. Barky's not here, is he? Um, Mr. Bond, I have been expecting you. <laughs> or even shaken, not stirred. More of a witch. More of a witch. Yeah. You're gonna, like. <laughs> You know, hocus pocus, I put a spell on you kind of thing. I'll just bugger off back to Wookie Hole then, shall I? They are living my cave! Cave! <laughs> but yeah, final thoughts on this. I absolutely love it. It's very, very out there, very kind of thing that I would wear when I like to dress up and go out in it, go to dinner in it, go to a wedding in it. Perhaps it's not appropriate to go to a funeral in it, as you suggested earlier, but I can wear it with my wide brimmed hat in the summer and, yeah, dressy. A great alternative to a dress as well, actually. I could wear this to my master's graduation. Imagine that with the robes and the cap. Ooh. <laughs> Double capiness. Cloak cape. It's a, it's, it's a cloak you get there. Gown. gown. Same thing. <laughs> I know what I mean. At least then I wouldn't look like I was Eddie the Eagle out of um, No Up It's Christmas Carol when he's talking to Ebenezer Scrooge when it's Scrooge at school. But hey! Final thoughts on this jumpsuit. I absolutely love it and it's a double thumbs up from me. Yeah. Final thoughts on refashion. I've actually really enjoyed my shopping experience with refashion. I think my favourite thing so far to come out of the whole haul was um, the Boohoo jumpsuit, which is brand new. I absolutely love the little capy sleeves on it and flashing them around rather than like a little bat. That's going to come in absolutely great because I've got a couple of weddings to go to next year and I know that that's going to be absolutely great for the evening party. I also really like the shipping. It's quite good value and it was quite quick. So the shipping costs £3.50 for my items and that's a standard charge across everything and my items were also dispatched within a day and I thought this was quite quick because I ordered these things over Christmas and I thought with everybody like in full-on Christmas mode and therefore was at work and on holidays I thought that it would take them a little while longer to dispatch no next day within two days it was here at my house which is absolutely great so the shipping times are really good I'd actually fully recommend refashion all three of my items have raised a bit of money for breast cancer now, so I'm extra pleased about that. Um, great value for money, and yeah, I'll definitely do another haul and probably also film myself doing another mini haul video later on in the year. If you like that video, make sure to give me a like or subscribe, and let me know what you think in the comments below. See you all soon. Bye! Oh, I know who you look like. Who? Like Madison Lee from Charlie's Angels Full Throttle. You know when she like turns around the balcony and... Around slowly. Yes. And then... Yeah, exactly. And the Terminator guy's dead. Yeah. yeah. Spoilers. Spoiler alert. <laughs>